Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Gina and I'm really happy to have you here. And I would love for you to subscribe to stick around for my future videos. But for today's video, as you see by the title, I am doing a jewelry collection slash kind of organize my jewelry. I have been having um, a specific organizer box that I got from Amazon a couple years ago. And it's just, I have so much jewelry and it, that box is kind of getting small to fit everything in it. And because it is small, it's really hard to organize my jewelry in a way where it's, I can effectively see it and actually wear it so I end up not wearing most of my jewelry I end up just sticking to this necklace and then the rings and just like my hoops so I wanted to organize all of my jewelry in a way where it's so easy for me to see it and hopefully that can help me wear my jewelry a little bit more often so I thought that would be an interesting video so I wanted to film it for you guys I am trying to make it um, kind of like a vlog style so I just want to maybe help you give you a little bit of inspiration if you want to organize your jewelry maybe this will be a little bit helpful I did buy a few things from Amazon that will help me organize my jewelry a little bit more so let me show you how my jewelry look like right now like what the box look like and how I organize it right now and let me show you what I got also from Amazon and kind of what I'm thinking of doing to help kind of organize it a little bit more okay so the box that I have been using lately is this box and I got that one from Amazon like a couple years ago and it's super cute let me show you so it's like gray full leather for your jewelry like it's just like a box and then you open it and you have your jewelry so you can even see like it's just not a good jewelry box like I do not like this at all because this is not high enough for the necklaces to stop falling down so every time like I would close it the necklaces will fall out of it so even if like I tuck everything in and then I do it again they it's they still fall out of it and then yeah now they're out again so it's just I don't know just not helpful at all and then every time like I would do that it would get stuck to something else like it would get stuck to something on here so just I don't really like this so I want to like organize my necklaces in a different way and you open it you have all these organizing like spaces so I have all of my earrings here I have more earrings here these are all ear cuffs that I absolutely love I have my watches back here I have some bracelets and just another couple watches that I have and then a lot more bracelets in here and here is more like ear cuffs that just don't fit that are a little bit bigger and yeah this one is like an Apple watch band that I had it tuck in here but again they keep falling out because just this is just not it just doesn't work so this is the first layer, then you lift it up and there is another layer underneath. So this is a little bit more bigger compartments where you can put like maybe bigger hoops, uh, bigger necklaces or like just bigger anything. So I have a little bit of like bigger statement earrings in here. I have a lot of hoops. Um, I also have like some of these like bracelets. And I have some necklaces in here, some beads. I have this big boho like necklace that I really like. I feel like this one's such a statement for like um, any concerts or I don't know, like any festival. I feel like this is so cute for that. And just a lot more statement earrings. So I have them down here. So the issue with that is because this is on top. I really never get to see what's on the bottom unless like I actually physically remove this so it's just not something that is super easy I just feel too lazy to remove this just to see what's underneath so I end up actually not using any of these so I kind of want to change that I want to change the necklaces and I also bought a lot more like ear cuffs over the last couple months that I kind of want to just organize these a little bit more efficiently I also feel like I have so many like rings that I feel like I would like 
for them to be displayed in a better way because I feel like they're just a little bit more cramped in here. So yeah, this is just how my jewelry box have been looking like the past couple months. But just want to organize it a little bit more. So let me just show you what I bought from Amazon. This is the first thing that I got from Amazon. This is a jewelry box organizer. Um, it was not expensive at all. I think it was like $24. I bought actually two similar um, boxes, but this one is actually way better quality than the other one, so I'm not going to show you the other one because it's just not a good quality at all. I will not recommend you something that I don't think is good quality, but I think this one is. And this is what it looks like. So it is three drawer jewelry box and really like how this one looks. It's not just acrylic. I don't know how to say that word. But it's not just like an acrylic box, it's like it has this um, a little bit of organizer, it feels really soft. The first drawer looks like this, so you have a little bit more space for your rings and then you have four more other bigger compartments to maybe like put smaller hoops, maybe put, I don't know, earrings, rings, anything like that. So this is the first drawer. Then the second drawer, it is just like these four compartments and this one long one. So I feel like this one could also be adjusted, but I don't know. I'm probably just gonna keep it the way it is, but this is probably just for like bigger statement earrings, anything like that. And then the last drawer is just empty space. So you can put maybe like your big watches, anything like that. This is what I bought to help organize my jewelry, like my like statement, earrings, my ear cuffs, my rings, all of that. So that will go in here. For my necklace situation, I wanted something that I could put my necklaces in and have them hang to be able to just see it right away and be able to pick up the necklaces. And I did not, and I wanted to be able to separate my necklaces from the rest of my earrings. I just don't want my necklaces to be like laid down at all or I don't I don't want them to be laid down in any part of the storage. So I want them to just be hung all the time, but I didn't want to just get any of those like necklace stands just because they are not enclosed. They're usually like you just hang your necklace and that's it. It's just like out open in the air. And I don't really like that. I feel like it just collects dust and it helps the jewelry to rust a lot quicker. And I don't like that. I wanted something that is going to be enclosed. So I found this on Amazon. I'm not going to lie. This is probably like not like the best quality. However, it does the job. So, and I bought this one and they sent it broken. And then I had to order a replacement. And from reading the reviews, it seems to be something that's happening a lot. So just keep that in mind. But I got the second one. It seems to be good. But you basically open it. And then you have this like carousel thing that just twists. And you can hang your necklaces on here. This one is a little bit wobbly. So just keep that in mind. So you just have to kind of like make sure to weigh the necklaces together so it's not like wobbly or anything like that but i feel like this one just does the job i like the fact that it has this door so it just keeps like the necklaces out not as exposed too much to the air let's just say that so i feel like this one will do the job from separating my necklaces from the rest of my jewelry i'm going to try to focus on the jewelry that i use or would want to use on the daily basis and probably the other jewelry that I feel like I'm not going to use as much, I'm going to keep it in the original box.
let me kind of take you through what I put in each drawer. So in the first drawer, I put my rings on top here. I put earrings and ear cuffs in the bottom. And then I kind of squeezed in a few hoops. But love this pair. This one is from Etsy. And I also got these two from Etsy as well. Most of all these ear cuffs are from a brand called Milk. So ear cuff kind of go around your ears and it doesn't require piercing. So it's super easy to put on if you don't want to commit to a piercing. This one is a great option. On this side I have some hoops, different sizes. And I have this pair. Of earring and this fun one as well too that's called excuse me and this one um, it's just a question mark on this side I have more cuffs and on here I also have more ear cuffs but this one is really adorable I love the snake with the rhinestones and it has these green eyes but love this one it can go in your ear hole and then the top part goes around your ears, but this is definitely one of my favorite ear cuffs. I have another one in here as well too, and then another ear cuff, and then this fun one, and this one goes all around the ear. So that's what I have in drawer number one. In drawer number two, I have more earrings here, so all of these are from that brand Nilk. They are a Turkish jewelry brand. I love everything that they do have. They sell unique jewelry pieces that you can't find anywhere else. And I have a few silver hoops in here as well as a couple gold ones. And then I have these two bracelets and these hoops as well too. They are kind of like Tritone, they're also from Nilk, and I have this statement earring as well, and this fun one from Nilk as well. But yeah, this is what I have in drawer number two. In drawer number three, I have all of my bracelets, my Louis Vuitton bracelets, and also my watches. So this watch is absolutely my favorite. So this is the Raymond Weil watch. Love this watch. Such a luxury watch. I absolutely love it. I love the fact that it also has like two tones, silver and gold, because I do have so many silver and gold pieces. So it's really nice to have a watch that goes with both. And then I have this silver watch. This one is just from Belova. And I have these bracelets. So all of these bracelets are from Nilk as well. And I also have this earrings that says Dream on it. And I have two ankle chains in here. But yeah, this is what I have in the third drawer. I finished putting all of my necklaces in here, so let me show you kind of how I organized it. So I added all of my gold necklaces at the front here, and then if you just kind of turn this, I have here all of my silver necklaces as well too. It's just super easy to kind of get into it if there is a necklace that i want i can just grab it and it's just super easy to see and super easy to kind of get out and i really like the fact that i can just close it and it is kind of safe from a lot of moisture in the air but love this i honestly really happy with how it turned out so going back to the original box i have so much more jewelry in here so this is going to be like pieces that i just don't really wear that often or i just don't really like so i'm probably not going to really be reaching for that often so i just kept them in this old jewelry box and i don't really have any necklaces in here anymore i just left it did not want to deal with this whole um, mess of it. So I put here some of my bracelets and then more ear cuffs in the back here. And I have all of my Apple Band watches, my two extra watch in here, and more bracelets. I have this star earrings, some more rings, and some more 
earrings that I just didn't really feel like putting in the other box and then a little bit more hoops and rings as well too. It's nice because now each pair or each earring has its own kind of compartment so it's not like cluttered anymore. And then if you lift this up you have more of like the statement earrings in here so bigger hoops this funky looking one and then this one is kind of um it's like a hair jewelry piece thing statement that i got and i have more earrings in here more hoops and then these nice looking ones these are definitely something like i would wear for christmas and these statement earrings as well as these on top this pearl necklace and these drop, um, I don't know what these are called, like yarn looking earrings and the rest of my bracelets in here as well. But yeah, this is kind of what this jewelry box looks like now. It's definitely a lot more organized than before. But yeah, that will be it for today's video, guys. I hope you, you guys liked it and found it helpful and give you a little bit of inspiration to organize your jewelry and maybe some tools on how you could do so. I will link both boxes that I got from Amazon in the description box just for your reference so you can know exactly what I got. But I hope you guys liked today's video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys